Hey guys, what is going on? It is Mark here, and today in the background, I'm not sure what my score is exactly, but um, we're playing Domination on a Raid, and I know I go on a 15 gun streak, but I also go ahead and get that Lodestar, which just happens to be my favorite kill streak of all time. Um, put aside like the Moab and the Kim Strike and the DNA and whatnot. Um, but yeah, if you don't count those, and the Lodestar is by far my favorite. And Swarm is a close second, so just saying that Black Ops 2 has some pretty amazing kill streaks. And that's kind of what I want to talk about. I kind of want to talk about like the Black Ops 3 kill streaks and you know like from the beta, what I expect like the game to be like compared to this uh, kill streak wise. So. Yeah, we all know Black Ops 2 was a great game. You know, the only thing I wish that they had in there was a, like, a Moab or something. I know they had the nuclear, which I never got one in this game, still working on it. But I just wish that they had, like, a little bomb. Or, a little bomb, but <laughs> a bomb of some type that just goes off and kills everybody. Or, you know, something to that effect. But, yeah, I mean, other than that, their kill streaks were pretty solid you know you, you actually felt like they were worth something whenever you got them uh, it, made, it made you feel rewarded whenever you got those kill streaks other than like ghosts because ghosts those kill streaks were so underpowered other than like the dog which was only like four kills with hardline and the IMS which was also four kills so like games like that is like really really terrible I mean Back in MW2 when you had like the chopper gun and the harriers and then the new of course who were really OP and that was really fun and But going back to Black Ops 2 because we I want to stay on topic here. I was kind of like drifting away But yeah back to Black Ops 2 their kill streaks really awesome You know one of my favorite kill streaks of the low star or it is my favorite kill streak Sorry, but because it's just like a shot after shot if you remember the Reaper from MW3 it's like that on steroids, but I want to see more things like that in Black Ops 3 and so far in the beta what we have saw was I saw like some decent kill streaks. No, they're not terrible, but they're not OP. And I don't know, like they're not really all that rewarding, but you know, you get a, a small sense of satisfaction because I just want something that can go in and get me like a bunch of kills when I deserve it. I can understand that the lower kill streaks maybe get you a couple kills. But in this game, like everything, even the sentry guns, they could go in and last forever. And I'm Black Ops 3, I'm hoping they have that too. I'm hoping the kill streaks are OP. You know, not like to an extreme amount, but I want it to be similar to Black Ops 2 because I feel like a lot of people did like this game. And, you know, it was pretty hard. Like the point system, or the, I'm going to call it the point system. I believe it was new in this game. I act actually am pretty sure. You know what? I'm right. Point system was new in this game, so, you know. The reason that they may have been OP was because they it was the first year trying out the um, you know the point streak system, and they were just trying to find a balance in that. But in reality, you know it's a really it's a really good idea. But I just hope that the you know the kill streaks in Black Ops 3 are just as good, if not better, because so far what I've seen was some mediocre kill streaks. And you know the wraps so far, my favorite kill streak. And, you know, those go in pretty well. I got a couple of those when I was playing the beta. But other than that, I really didn't use anything that actually got me kills. And that kind of worries me because what I play for and I think what a lot of people play for is for fun. And to have fun, you know, you go for kills, you kill whore and do stuff like that. But if you don't have kill streaks and you have to rely all on, you know, your gun skill and whatnot, it's going to get frustrating at times because you're going to run into good players and you're not going to be able to get those high gameplays with just your gun. And the kill streaks don't help you have fun and to relieve kind of, you know, the, I'm going to say stress, even though it's not, it shouldn't be stress. Um, but yeah, kill streaks, kill streaks, kill streaks. Please be good to Black Ops 3. So guys, with that being said, I know that all of my commentaries are like cut short with the gameplay, but um, I hope you guys are okay with that because I really can't talk about kill streaks for a whole ten minutes. I don't think so, but yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy this gameplay. And um, also, guys, if you could like and subscribe, it would help me out greatly. I'd greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate it as well. So guys, I will see you guys later. Peace out. Star awaiting orders. Securing Bravo. Losing Charlie. Good 
job, grunts. Get ready for the next round. Domination. Capture the objectives. Securing Charlie. Care package inbound. Charlie locked down. We're winning this fight. Enemy has Alpha. Friendly Lodestar inbound. Friendly RCXD inbound. Warthog inbound. Pushing your location. Be advised. Hostile hunter killer drone inbound. Good strike. Be advised. Hostile UAV incoming. Target above. Guns, guns, guns. Good hit. Orbital VSAT online. Friendly hunter killer drone deployed. Losing Bravo. Alpha. Securing C. C locked down. Securing A. Hostile UAV above. Flag secured, maintain current posture. Losing Bravo. Losing C. Enemy has Charlie. Be advised, your sentry gun has been destroyed. Killer drone inbound. He's gone. Losing B. On me.
job done. 